speaker is Marcel. He talks about Agile Admin. Hello, everybody. Um, yeah, I would like to talk about Agile way for sysadmins. Agile becomes more and more yeah, common in software development, like test-driven and something like that. In 2006, I wrote an essay about, um, and I analyzed how to uh, adaptate or how to transfer the knowledge of Crystal, Scrum, and extreme programming, or special test-driven development. Um, to system administration, so agile values, principles, and practices, and try to yeah, how how we can use this at uh, system administrators. So that what was my job at this time, and yeah, I call this um, agile system administration. And if we are looking for that, it's not just a transfer of knowledge; it's also a, yeah, a search for the best practices for sysadmins, and that's what I would like to discuss or would like to find people who would like to. Um, search for nice practices. And I want to introduce you um, a couple of ideas that um, may be quite common or known. Uh, for example, if every, someone hears first time about um, extreme programming, if, oh, that's pair programming. Yeah, I know. To sitting two people in front of a keyboard, driver, co-driver, writing a test and then implementing the stuff. Um, but it's not that all. This is the same in system administration. If you have a time problem, time-based um, issue, yeah, two people in front of a keyboard, I, of course, yeah, I do that. Um, if we are thinking about self-organized teams, um, it's quite useful to learn something, so to have a look back in the past and, yeah, to use your retrospectives. And if you're working in self-organized teams, you... Um, need some values to, to think about how, how that can work. And um, they're not my ideas. So the Usenix, which is a subgroup of um, the Sage, sage.org, um, introduced the code of ethics for sysadmins, which is um, uh, some rules, it's like 10 rules or so, to how, how you can work. And yeah, for me, it's, I, get, I get very into uh, tests, running tests in a in, in, um, network environment like Nagios. What is it in English? Nagers. <laughs> and yes, in this way, I like this test stuff and to, to um, stop writing every paper documentation, which is just crap. Um, this is the idea of uh, development as well. Like, you have just tests and that is your documentation. Um, so, and there are other ways. I, I wrote responsibility on my slide. This means, like, um, if, you, if you have to... Uh, hold the system running or the network running, I want to make the decision how that could work or uh, which uh, technical, which, 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 which technique we um, yeah, choose to, to solve the problem. And I don't want to discuss quality. So this is XP as well. Like, um, I want to be, um, yeah, I want to be uh, um, like what I've done. So um, I want to make it secure and to make it fail proof and make it tested and to be sure that it's, it's, um, it's okay. So um, if you're interested in stuff like this, I've re um, recorded in 2006, it's quite um, a time ago, <laughs> a podcast with uh, a friend of mine, Basti, and it's, it's in German, but it's, um, it's about extreme administrating, which was the first title, but it's, this title is sh um, not so good, okay? And um, yeah, have a look at the code of ethics from Sage, and um, I like these ideas, and I would like to find people who are interested in uh, setting up a domain, setting up a wiki, and uh, yeah. Yeah, collecting ideas. Thank you very much. So, thanks, Marcel, for presenting us Agile Admin. Next speaker is